Your headphone jack on your smartphone is going away. How will you listen to your music, your podcast, or whatever? I'll tell you after this little fancy intro here. This is iTony Tech, simple, easy tech news for the passive geek. There have been rumors for a while that Apple was gonna build iPhones with no headphone jack. Motorola just released two smartphones with no headphone jack, the Moto Z and the Moto Z Force. They've got no headphone jack. What's a person to do with no headphone jack? Well, Diego, Bluetooth. Bluetooth headsets are a serious thing. I needed some headphones for my radio show and I had to look pretty hard for wired headphones. But Tony, I just bought some expensive wired headphones. Well, sell them. Nah, -uh, you ain't gotta sell them. Wired headphones, which actually will always be better than wireless headphones, connect to your phone using the port you have to charge your phone. Now, if your headphones don't have that kind of connector, don't worry about it. You'll be able to buy an adapter dongle kind of thing. Oh, they're gonna get in your pocket one way or another. Now, why are they eliminating the headphone jack? Well, think about this. Your smartphone is jam-packed with all kinds of stuff. Memory and flash drive, the screen, doohickeys and stuff. The headphone jack takes up valuable real estate. They can use that space for bigger things, like a bigger battery. With iOS 9, your iPad has been able to do the picture-in-picture -picture thing for video playback, but it didn't work with Netflix, but it does now. This past Tuesday, Netflix updated their iPad app, so now Netflix will minimize into a small screen when you hit the home button. They call that small screen thumbnail mode. Now you do need iOS version 9.3.2 or later. How do you know which version you have on your iPad? We'll go to settings, then about, and then look for versions. A survey of 18 to 24 year olds showed that they're not getting their news from TV. They're getting the news from social media. 28% get their news from social media, 24% get news from TV. Over half of people with access to the web get their news from social media. The top social media sites for news across 26 countries, Facebook, number one, followed by YouTube. WhatsApp's number three, Twitter, and then Instagram is number five. How do you get your news? Take the poll question here. Hey, that's all I got. Hopefully I did enough for a thumbs up from you. Now, if I blew your mind, you can reward me by subscribing. If you want to help support the channel, you can become a patron of mine on patreon.com for 99 cents a month. The link for that and everything I talked about is in the description below. Thanks for checking out iTony Tech. Simple, easy tech news for the passive geek. I'm Tony Scott.